Hello guys, this is the Swatter Guy here, and welcome back to another Worth It episode. And this one is gonna be the 40th, I think, so it's time for a giveaway. So write down and spam the comment section below your character name, your server, your faction, and obviously a random number of your choice, and the winner will be announced as soon as this video comes out a week later. So uh, spam it in the comments and uh, you get yourself a super crate of your choice and obviously write down the super crate which one you want obviously I forgot to mention that but now we're gonna open the new packs which is the vigilant hyper crates which came out not so long ago and there will be no music no sound no nothing I mean the game sounds obviously and nothing else so we're gonna open the vigilant defender packs and it's actually pretty high priced I really don't understand why but there is a lot of like high priced items in there for example the throne is 50 million right now the corrupted acolyte is 5 million I don't know about the rest but I don't want to spoil too much I opened five before so we'll see how this goes off so we're gonna buy the vigilant defender uh, packs and we'll see how this will go so 26 obviously four time each and at the end we are just gonna burn the rest of six the sound is pretty interesting I have a lot of tr item stashes in here but pretty much they are gifts and uh, uh, mm, scraps and things like that but we don't care for those we care for the new stuffs obviously in there there is this veteran there's two new gold uh, armor sets uh, a companion and obviously the flare which a lot of people are wanted to get I don't know how much is that at the moment but we'll see how this pack opening will go first off we're starting with a yellow gold and a chance cube Next one, we got ourselves a super rare item, and it is going to be the Reclusive Master Lower Body and the Oriconia Brazier, which I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, I saw that, and it's pretty decent. We got ourselves a Zaculian Falcon and a Zaculian Nobility Statue, which I think that is the best. Uh, I mean in the specs in general. We got ourselves another chance cube and the flag Corellia Republic. And uh, that's it for these items. So we're just gonna claim all of these and obviously we're gonna open the chance cubes. Uh, let's switch it to new and uh, those are gonna be okay. These are okay. And we got ourselves the Zaculium Falcon and that's about it. Let's open the two chance cubes see what we can we can get anything uh, we got ourselves the Corellis Countless and the next one is going to be a uh, Forest Lizard Bat which is a really old item I suppose okay so let's check out Hama Oaks I forgot to open the armor set which is the reclusive master which I think looks really really good so we got ourselves the yellow gold, which is 30k. Uh, we have a Corellia Republic for 200k. And this one is looking pretty alright. We got ourselves the Zaculian Nobility statue with 890k. And as I said, this statue is really cool. I mean, this statue in general looking is really cool. Uh, okay, we have the Forest Lizard Bat for 94k. We have the Oriconium Brazier for 650k. Like, this one is also really cool as well. Don't get me wrong. Uh, we got ourselves the Zaculium Falcon for 80k. We have the Corellis Countless for 7.9 million, which is really, really cool. We got ourselves the Reclusive Master for 1.1 million and this one is 700k. We're starting pretty solid, guys. Oops, wrong bay. We need to go into the free bay. And that's about it. 
Let's open the four more goodies and hope we can get something really sick out of these. Let's open these individuals. Got ourselves super rare, which is going to be the Protector's Command Throne and the Imperial Advisor Lower Body. Really cool. This one is 50 million, guys. Really, really cool. Next ones are going to be Coil Monitor and Wandering Discipline Upper Body Armor. Next ones are going to be Advanced Yellow and Imperial Advisor, and the final ones are going to be a Zaculium Falcon and the Oriconium Brazier, which is not that bad as well. So we're gonna change it to quality or Carta Rarity instead. And uh, these are, I think, fine. Okay, I think uh, we're missing these and this one. Uh, th those are explorations, whatever, whatever. Muja fruits. Okay, I think that's about it. Let's change it to new. I think this is how I just say it pretty right. Okay, uh, let's open the sets because these are pretty new and I don't know how much are these worth at the, at the moment. So let's check out these. So we first, we got ourselves this gold crystal, which is 40K. We got ourselves the command throne, the returning command throne for 15 million credits, which is incredibly good money. Next one is 445K for the Imperial Advisor belt. This one is 750. 14k for the Wandering Discipline, really good so far. Coil Monitor, which is 399k. Uh, Zaculum Falcon for 80k. Oriconium Brazil for 650k. Let's see the Imperial Advisor lower, 280k. This one is 35k. Let's see the head, 144k. Bracers. 20k and the final ones is 78k for the wandering discipline really weird stuffs going around uh, okay so far really good i really really liking these stuff so far okay next four tiers let's jump down uh so far we got two super rares we got ourselves the star fortress Scout and the Badlands Renegade, which I think is the worst set of all, all tier. Next ones are going to be two silvers, Imperial Advisor Upper and Lower. Next one. We got ourselves another super rare, which is going to be the Damaged Zaku Walker. I don't know how that looks. Badlands Renegade also at the end. Let's open these individuals. Nothing. We got ourselves another super rare Asylum Experimental Tank and the Odessan Raider Dish. So we got ourselves, I think, the two best decorations uh, so far. So we don't need that. We need this. We need these. We need this. 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 We don't need that. This one. Uh, we don't need these. And this one. That's about it. Yep. Okay, let's open the sets. We got ourselves two really, really good decorations. Imperial Visor, which is actually look, oops, actually pretty nice priced at the moment. I don't know why, because it's maybe looking pretty decent. So we got ourselves the Asylum Experimental Tank for 740k, and this one is pretty good. Like, not a simple Koto tank, but it's like something, somebody in there, which is really, really cool. Next one is going to be Badlands Renegade, 45k. This one was 280k. Let's see the Damage the Cool Walker, 725k. And this one is like not much of a big deal, to be perfectly honest. It's just as Damage the Cool Walker. And uh, really not much of a big deal. And I don't like it, to be perfectly honest. 85k for this. Let's see the Odessan Raider dish. 2 million. This is what I needed. And what the hell is this? It's like, uh, 
it's like a hologram radar coming around here or something like that i think so okay next one star fortress scout 92k badlands renegades are pre cheap 45k uh this one 20k twice that is 40k this one is 35k and the chest is 135k pretty good so far probably the prices are gonna drop down really soon so i really need to sell the gold ones before it goes down to like i don't know to for example the throne going down to five million or something like that otherwise this will be not a big profit for me oh oops wrong one okay next i said the next four and i'm pressing the room buttons okay next one let's go so we got three super rare so far i'm really good i mean this pack opening is really good royal guardian supplementary and advanced yellow which is not a big deal. next one's a chance cube is an and the new alliance defender time there's not much chance without dropping in this packs coil monitor and oriconium brazier and let's open these individual and these are gonna be Ortec F9 lightsaber and Warding Discipline lower body. I think this one is gonna be the worst for sure. Claim, Grand Chance Cube. Claim, uh, Claim. Sorry about the mails. I'm selling stuffs uh, while I'm opening some packs, so apologize for that. Uh, and uh, the coil monitor which I need and that's about it I think yeah we just need to open the chance cube which we're gonna open right now let's see what the stuff are we gonna get it's gonna be pale red and pale brown die model not much of a big deal and not really expected anything good out of these so we got two set bonuses uh, one has three items and the other one has two. Let's check out the prices. So we have this one for probably 45k, 29k even. Uh, let's see the pale brown. 200k. Wow. We have the Orthac F7 lightsaber, which is 335k. Really decent. Wardering Discipline 65k. Alliance Defender 20k. Coil monitor, 399k. This one is also, also looking pretty good as well. Uh, Royal Guardian, 36k. Royal Guardian helmet, 29k. Belt, probably the same, 28k. Yep. And this one is 70k. Well, this one was definitely the worst one uh, out of the tiers. But we have 10 more packs to open. Hopefully, our luck is going to be a little bit be better again because we still need i think a little bit more plus uh because at the moment we are pretty decent money but at the moment it's not that worth it so we have the imperial advisor oriconium brazier okay next one are going to be chance cube and the empowered shuffle which i made a video about when I was done uh, experimenting the pack. Uh, the next two is going to be Royal Guardian and Badlands Renegade, and the final ones are going to be Coil Monitor and the Grand Chance Cube. Uh, okay, so Badlands Renegade, okay, Coil Monitor, okay, Empire Shuffle, Shuffle, okay, two Chance Cubes, okay, Imperial Divisor, Oriconia and Brazil, this one, and that's about it. Let's open the two Chance Cubes, hopefully we gonna get something good out of this. Because we need the old, really old, Emo Chair 4, not a big deal. And the next one, or last one, is the Unknown Saber War was... I don't know if it's worth anything or not, to be perfectly honest, but we'll see. So, uh, I'm gonna open the, these uh, armor sets. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. 
good old brazier has been added, but we need to calculate two out of that because, where was it? There we go. Uh, because I accidentally clicked on that. Anyway, uh, so we have the Imperial Advisor 95K. We have the Coil Monitor for 399K. Empowered Shuffle, 300K, the single ladies shuffle. Saber Wasp uh, is 800k. Royal Guardian 590k, really decent. Oricon Brazil 720k twice, that is 1.4 million credits and 40k, I think. Emo Chair Force 450k. Badlands Renegade is 44k. And this one is 19 uh, Imperial Advisor 135k and the boots is 116k this is pretty decent but we need something big out of the last six packs because otherwise it will be not profitable for sure now let's open the last six ones and see what we're gonna get out of these so the first ones are going to be not super rares imperial advisor and badlands renegade Got ourselves a super rare finally, and it is the HK Hey K1, whatever H1K1 or Hi Kai Hi Kai H1K1. I don't know. Hey Hey One K1. I don't know. Well, at least we got ourselves that one for sure. And we got ourselves a platinum item, which is the unstable peacemaker lightsaber. And this is what we needed at the final time. Finally, I got myself the second platinum lightsaber, which is the unstable peacemaker lightsaber. And this time it's now a huge profit. Doesn't really matter what we're gonna get at these types what the hell a cunning status mess supplementary and a grand chance are we gonna get i thought we we're gonna get three super rares in a row statue of the dignified scholar really really cool name, by the way and the final ones are going to be the dual saber and the assault cannon which we not getting any weapons so far but the last uh, pack we got ourselves the weapons itself so we got ourselves a badlands we got ourselves a cartel market skiff which i think looks pretty cool cunning status man okay we got ourselves one chance cube uh h1k1 imperial advisor uh ortec assault uh ortec dual saber uh statue of the dignified scholar Unstable Peacemaker Lightsaber, and at the end is Wondering. So we got ourselves a lot of items, so we're gonna open these good old armor sets, which we need, the Cunning Status Man. We, oh, 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 I almost pressed the wrong button again, but thank God it is just taking time. And last but not least, let's open the last chance to see what we got at the end. And it's going to be the Green Adversary Empath Crystal. I don't know how old this crystal is, but we'll see about it in a second. So first, at the end of these packs, we got ourselves three super rare items. So the last pick, six packs, got three super rare items. Really, really good so far. And let's check out Cunning Status Man. 550k really good skiff 250k it's a shame because it's a really good i think uh mount 445k for the advisor belt let's see this crystal 250k okay let's see the h1k1 6 million credits really good uh we have this one again for 445k we have the salt cannon for for I don't know how much, 4,500. Probably this one is gonna be the same. 5,000, yeah, as I said. Statue of the Dignified Scholar, 1.5 
million credits and I think looks absolutely beautiful if you ask me but this one looks even more beautiful like Jesus this lightsaber and I don't know the price for this for example I'm checking this probably the third time but I didn't check it over a month and it's 50 million credits so we got the pack back so pretty much the unstable peacemaker lightsaber is worth my hyper crate so anything else what I received is a profit so that is huge uh, we got ourselves a wandering discipline but I don't want to open it yeah as you can see it's 2,000 credits uh, we got this one for 44k we got this one for 19k let's see the the cunning status man had 2.1 million really good cunning status man 250k uh, this one is 144k this one is 20k uh, we got this one again for 144k and this one for 20k uh, again guys this was a huge opening and i really really loved it and it's time now for the total calculation because it is gonna be a really huge profitable giveaway episode whatever but it is really really a good profit so let's go check out the prices i will be right back sorry i was away a little bit and i was counting really like slow or something like that and uh, the game decided to go and uh, disconnect or yeah pretty much log out so the total calculation has been done and it is really really a huge profit and i really needed this and i received 101 million credits and uh 734k or something like that which is absolutely a blast so pretty much i received the price twice so two hyper crates item so it's pretty much 51 million worth of profit and 734k obviously but the main issue is this pack like i don't know really contains a lot of gold items and that is why uh, maybe it's it's a little bit more like uh, pricey and the good thing is about this this uh, packs don't have too much items which i really glad because the previous uh, uh packs had a little bit too much more like a little bit too much uh items but this one don't and even though if i'm not received the peacemaker just the the hey one k one doesn't really matter how to say it it's up to you but uh, uh, if i receive the rest still it's gonna be still a profit but not that much probably like uh, three or four or five maximum million worth of money but other than that it is a really cool opening so pretty much we got ourselves the main things so we got ourselves the throne first after that the two rare decorations after that we got ourselves a few rare uh reclusive master set uh we got ourselves the the cunning status man cap we got ourselves the really cool decorations and at the end the unstable pacemaker lightsaber which is a really big big deal and also we got ourselves the uh companion as well so guys I hope you guys did enjoy this as i said this is a giveaway so write down in the comment section below your server name your faction uh your character name obviously uh your super crate your i mean your choice and at the end your number and uh best of luck to you guys you have one week to participate and good luck to each and every one of you and hopefully you're gonna get lucky same luck as me until then this was an absolutely amazing worth it and it's now definitely worth to give away so i will see you guys next time bye bye